My name is Mac Barnett, and I have uh, two books coming out this fall. One is Guess Again. Uh, the other one is The Brixton Brothers Number One, The Case of the Case of Mistaken Identity. It's the first in a series of uh, detective books. I introduced Steve Brixton, a, a, a new kid detective. Uh, he's, uh, he, he's learning the job, and uh, he, he's getting kidnapped a lot, tied up a lot, trying to solve a mystery uh, that involves a worldwide conspiracy. I do see myself in, in Steve Brixton, uh, who's the hero of the, the Brixton Brothers. Like him, I always wanted to be a detective, and, and, and also I, I suspect that I, I wouldn't be particularly good at that job. He's smart, he's got good deductive reasoning, but uh, you know, he, he's not a very fast runner, um, which, is, which is something that was true for me. But uh, I think Steve shows that you can, you, can, you can maybe not be a great sprinter, but still get the crime solved. I, I've been thinking a lot about, about a theme song to have as a detective, because I think it's important, you know, um, to, have, to have some good music. But, but, but I started worrying that uh, if my theme song was too catchy, I would probably start singing it on stakeouts and uh, while tailing somebody and kind of blow my cover that way. Every good detective has a, has a, has a great chum. So I think, I think the important thing uh, when you're looking for a chum is that they, uh, they're going to be willing to get kidnapped instead of you um, and, and probably to get in some fights on your behalf, maybe take a few punches that, that, that you dodge uh, and, and, and you know, be really good at, at crying for help because they'll probably be doing that a lot and it's usually also their, their responsibility to make the detective a, uh, a picnic lunch.